How to use JF Eagle Pro to jumpstart a vehicle and inflate a tire. Jump starting a vehicle can be done in four steps. First, switch on the unit and make sure the charge is over 50%. Next, attach the clamps, red to the positive, black to the negative. Plug the clamps cable in the port on the unit. And then, start the vehicle. Once the vehicle is on, disconnect the cable from the unit, then remove the clamps from the battery. You can simply inflate the tire with JF Eagle in four steps. Take out the air hose from the back and power on the unit. Next, press unit to choose the metric. Then press plus or minus to set desired pressure and wait until the number stops flashing. Screw the air hose directly onto the tire or connect to the extensional hose before attaching to the tire depending on your need. After that, the current pressure will be displayed on the screen. Switch on the red button to begin to inflate the tire. It will automatically shut off when reaching the preset pressure. Remember to stop in every 10 minutes to cool down the inflator for 5 minutes. Once it's finished, switch off the red button and remove the air hose from the tire and store it back on the unit. You can either power off the unit manually or wait for it to shut off automatically 3 minutes later. How to use other functions on JF Eagle Steps to use the light Long press the power button to switch on the light. The default mode is long lighting. Press once at a time to switch to strobe, SOS, and off. How to charge devices Connect the devices from the USB port, then power on the unit to charge. How to recharge the unit JF Eagle Jump Starter has two ways to recharge AC port or DC car adapter Simply connect the unit with the power port The screen will display the charge level and the flashing in It isn't until the in stops flashing The unit is fully charged 